Okay, here is the machine that does the miracle job of transferring the 60-year-old movie film into digital. Called Wolverine. And here it is in action. It takes a picture of each and every frame puts it on a, a little disc card which you then put in your computer and you can then put I put it then put it in movie maker and edit it and add sound and what it, I'm, what it, music or whatever this is what creates those beautiful beautiful digital images. Now this will take one this size, the reel this size will take about three hours. As you can see <laughs> each and every frame is digitized. Okay now it says put that information into this little card right here. So what I'm going to do is put in my reader here and watch what happens to the screen here. Film scanner. There it is. Scenes of the Philippines. It looks too good. The titles are not that great. This is back when you had to hand do those titles. No, they were all drop off, but it's just the title for some reason. So, I mean, you, but you had to... Oh, yeah, the, yeah. I put them in one letter at a time. Took hours and hours and hours to do this. And here's... Actually, that's Subic Bay, I think. And then what I'll do is, is I, will, I will transfer, I'll open this in Windows Movie Maker, and I can edit it. And I can cut out all the splices and rearrange the scenes and then add transitions. And titles. And titles. The other yeah. titles. The end titles. Okay, now. I'm going to open with Movie Maker. That's Windows Movie Maker. Then I can start working with it, but first it's got to load all this in. And then, even if I want to split it up and just do individual sections, it's already worked into movies in Windows Movie Maker, so that I don't have to wait for it to reload. And so I can, if I want to split it up into different things, I can. Ah, oh, the wonders of the digital age.